So it's grocery day. So you know what that means. I ordered us the breakfast of champions or Canadian classic breakfast. Tim Hortons donuts and coffee. For myself, it's an ice cap with a double shot of espresso. The girls, I treated to a caramel ice or ice cap. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was looking for. Anyways, uh, I'm going to go ahead and put away all the groceries that I showed you on my last video, process my meat, and wash my fruit, and I'll be back for lunch. Well, lunch has arrived. This is the cheeseburger pizza. I gotta say, it looks pretty darn good. And here is my thin crust veggie pizza. I'm pretty excited about this. Alright, well we've had enough fast food and junk, so this morning I decided to get a little fancy and I am using some of that apple cinnamon uh, raisin bread. Um, some of the stuff for French toast. Autumn and I will be eating some of this and my eldest daughter just had plain bread uh, for French toast and we're going to pair with a side of fruit and uh, whipped cream if they want some. Alright, here is our breakfast. Feast all finished. Uh, again, this is for Autumn and I. I mean, obviously we're not going to eat all of that, but the pieces are really, really small. Um, I've got some fruit here, some whipped cream should anyone want it, and some pure maple syrup. So we're just going to dig in. This is uh, a far sight healthier, I guess you could say, than what we've been eating the last couple days, but Today is a new day, so we're going to have this, and then I don't know what we're going to have for the rest of the day, but I will be sure to show you guys. Alright, we got a little bonus. This comes from the, well, actually, I think Walmart, actually. I was going to say Superstore, but... Pretty sure it was Walmart. Anyways, I got some pork chops because, well, mine are frozen, frozen. Like, I got lazy and didn't take them out in time. So, Instacart to the rescue. I ordered some pork chops for dinner tonight. I ordered some of these frosted soft sugar cookies because I seen them on Miranda's channel uh, over at Plus Size in Canada. And I thought maybe my girls might like that. Some sliced mushrooms, some zucchini, replacement strawberries because we are plowing through ours, and then because my man-child, aka husband, uh, was vocally complaining that he wanted chocolate, I did a thing. I probably shouldn't have done it, but I bought chocolate, and I'm going to ration it because he's a pig, and he'll eat it all, and I may or may not want one of these. Anyways, I've got a package of mini Wonder Bars. I can't find like the full size anymore. Uh, coffee crisps, so a pack of four. Pack of four rolls, because oh, basically because I've never seen them in this kind of package, where you get like four of those. And a four pack of Snickers. So that is his chocolate fix, I am going to say, for the next little bit. All of this came to about about $45, but Instacart charged $55. So I was stumped for tonight's dinner, and I am basically over mashed potatoes. Rob doesn't care for baked potatoes. So I'm going to try a new recipe for scalloped potatoes. Now, ordinarily, I would, um, you know, use the cream and flour and all that stuff. But this one said I could use condensed soup, so like cream of mushroom or cream of celery. And I didn't want to use that, so I'm using the cream of cheddar soup with uh, about a quarter cup or whatever of milk. I don't know. I didn't really measure. I'm eyeballing and winging it. But anyways, I put a little bit of milk, uh, some soup, and some cheese with garlic and salt and pepper. Uh, I'm going to be topping this with a little bit of parsley, baking at... 350 for 45 minutes and I'm going to pair that with the rest of dinner um, It's looking like a pork chop kind of night and uh, Probably pair that with some Zucchini and mushroom medley. I love that 
I will show you uh, once I'm at the next step. So I separated my pork chops and I'm only going to do three of them because my eldest isn't going to eat this. But, and I highly doubt Rob's going to have seconds and I'm trying to watch my portions. So one for each of us and I am going to brush some of this Stubbs sticky sweet on it and just fry them in the frying pan. This is smelling so good. Look at the crust on that one. Mm, mm, mm. Oh my lanta. Look at this. It's still bubbling and it looks so good. Autumn already ate her pork chop and she's just waiting for some of this because she was ravenous. She said it was like delicious. So I'm so excited to eat. Okay, I'm covering my mouth because I'm chewing, and I never do this. I never ever hop on here mid meal, but I have to say, this is the best barbecue sauce I've ever had. Oh my god! Mm. Mm. <laughs> this is the wreckage that I call my plate. Um, I gotta say, the barbecue sauce absolutely made the meals a hundred percent. Um, scalloped potatoes are delicious. I swear, like, I'm gonna have to, like, buy this barbecue sauce by the gallon. So, in case you didn't catch it, it's Stubbs, uh, Sweet and Sticky. Or Sticky Sweet. Oh, phenomenal. 10 out of 10. I recommend. Happy Friday, guys. It's Friday. Uh, it's officially the weekend. I just wanted to hop on here and, like, let you guys know that today is a momentous day. I even did my makeup for it and, like, my hair. My hair is pink now, yes. Um, but I'm, gonna, I'm getting my vaccine today. So it's a controversial subject, but I'm, like, really excited because to me that means I may be able to go back to some kind of normalcy. In life not much of it but like the numbers will drop I'm doing my part and I feel good about it but anyways I just wanted to hop on here and like commemorate it I guess and um, let you guys know that I love you guys and I'll be back so uh, keep your eyes peeled if you like this kind of content please consider subscribing um, and leave me some love in the comments all right guys bye sayonara